Hi guys, so I'm back with September favorites. I'm not sure when this is going to go up, so I hope it's right around the end of September, first week of October, but um, <laughs> with the, uh, if you guys have been watching, um, with the move coming up for me, um, I don't know when things are going up. But anyway, I wanted to dive in. It's been a while since I've done a favorites video. And I honestly can't tell you if I did one in August or not. I didn't go back and look before I started this video, and I probably should have. Um, but I have several things to show you that I'm real excited about. I believe they're all still available. Yes, I think they were, you can go purchase all of these things. Um, and I just love everything. So, <laughs> okay, Jade. Um, <laughs> so let's get started. I wanted to talk about the IT Cosmetics CC Plus. CC Cream! Um, I was late on getting this. Mindy's had this all summer and raved about it. In fact, I'm pretty sure she's finished a tube and maybe even got another tube already. Um, love this stuff. I got the shade medium. I'm wearing it today. Now, I probably do three quarters of a pump, maybe half to three quarters of a pump to get the coverage that I need. I know most people will use one to two pumps, but I love this stuff. I think it's great coverage. Um, doesn't dry me out. And anything that says anti-aging, I'm like, yay! <laughs> but no, I've really been impressed with this, and so far I use this with my hands, and it's everything is fine. But um, I am one of the later people getting to this. But I feel like over the summer, I did start getting into uh, wanting to try more. Like, not foundations, because I'm not really a foundation girl, but something a little more than just a BB cream. Now, don't get me wrong, I still love my BB creams. Um, but I have enjoyed this. This is going to be nice to have something that I can have a little more, a little bit more, um, a little, okay, spit it out. <laughs> Fuller coverage on, but not full. You know what I'm saying? Like medium, light to medium coverage. It's perfect. But I have loved that. And um, since we've been packing up to move, basically everything I have is in a travel makeup bag. So this has gotten a lot of love. And this is why I'm talking about this one and not, um, I got a new Tarte uh, full coverage one. I hauled that in my last haul. Have used it and liked it, but I'll be talking about that hopefully soon. But it's been packed away. I've pretty much been using um, like what's what can fit in a travel makeup bag. So that's that. Um, oh my gosh this Chanel it's the volume La Volume de Chanel mascara it is in black it says number 10 anyway I think I don't know if it only comes in black or not to be honest with you this was a birthday gift from Mindy and I had no idea she was getting it um can I just say this is the wand this is oh my gosh I just realized I did not put on mascara today I did not I forgot to put mascara on did I forget to put mascara on Hold, please. I did! I forgot. I was putting my makeup on so fast. Um, <laughs> okay, guys. So, I actually forgot to put mascara on today. And I just put mascara on this eye. And I don't think with the lighting and how I'm sitting and how far away I'm sitting um, that you're going to be able to see this. But, oh my goodness. It is such... It is such a difference. I swear. Um, I'm going to quickly put a coat on the other side. You know, that is typical. I got up to film videos this morning way early, as in before 8 a.m. early, which is way early to me, and um, was like, wow, I rolled through putting my makeup on. Yeah, it's because I forgot a whole step. That is typical. This is why I have to keep mascara and stuff um, at my desk. Anyway, I just want to say that this mascara is amazing I love it so so much enough that my I let my mom try it she bought one while we were in New York in New York and has since bought a friend of hers one and I told Mindy this is in my top five uh, this might be oh my gosh the Lorac Pro and this one benefit they're real I like the hourglass and the MAC um, false false lashes falsies false lashes I think um, not the waterproof because that was horrible but this is this is high up on the, the the top five list this might be oh my gosh this and the Lorac Pro are probably neck and neck for each other but I don't know this is beautiful you know what I love about it 
it uh, I have teeny tiny lashes and I think it does three things I think it volumizes which is fabulous it lengthens mine which is amazing and I think it kind of curls them I don't curl my lashes um I just I'll tell you when I've used this and some other makeup recently my husband has said your makeup looks really good your lashes look crazy and crazy isn't a good thing and I'm like yes so I don't know if you've tried it um it's pricey I think it's thirty dollars thirty some dollars um to me it's worth it and when this baby runs out I will go get another one I would love to know what you guys think mascara is different for everyone um what works for what works for Mindy might not work for me, but this, I'm telling you, is worth a try. And get it from a store if you guys want to. Get it from a store that you can return it if it doesn't live up to what you think it should do for you. But for me and my baby lashes and my mom and her ultra baby lashes, beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Thank you, Mindy, for um, thinking of me with that because it is amazing. Um, okay, so speaking of Mindy, she gave me... Uh, another gift that I have been loving and it's the new Stila lip glosses and this is the shade Garnet. Uh, oh my gosh, I love it. I love, love, love it. I'm actually wearing a nude color right now. I'm wearing Tarte uh, Shiraz. I'm going to put this on over it. Oh man. It smells good. It feels good. It's a little sticky, which, not crazy sticky, a little that's perfect, um, but she is beautiful. Garnet. If you guys, you guys probably should go into the store and try some of these new lip glosses. They're amazing. Again, um, so, raved over it so much that um, my mom got one too. And it looks great on her. And I love that my mom is wearing lip glosses because she didn't for a long time. Uh, one go-to eye look that I've been wearing for lazy days has been this Mally stick um it's in the shape gosh I don't even know what it's called oh dusk I, we got this in the QVC new beauty test tube we hauled it in the car we opened the box <laughs> and it's kind of an amethyst shade and what I've been doing is slapping a little primer on putting it all over my lid and just buffing it out with my fingers is what I'm wearing today um it provides the most subtle shimmer sparkle i love these things they're so easy so nice um this color is perfect for this time of year and i've been pairing it with which i don't know if i've talked about this i think i hauled it the smashbox always sharp waterproof liner in french navy beautiful 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 i love navy and this amethyst color together um and under my lashes today i have this on just easy so easy it's like a one look and you're done but i've just loved the pairing of those two anyway okay the next things are palettes of sorts um this one she's so beautiful my hand, grubby hand prints are all over it that i do carry her in this little velvet palette it is the guerlain mm -hmm. <laughs> and it is a let's see it's Le, Le Fumes, Le Fume, something like that, and we have, it's a quad, yes, it's a quad, and it is more of your neutral colors. Now, I have to say, this was a gift from my beautiful friend, uh, Kristen Game, here on YouTube, and I think this is one of her favorite palettes. I've never had anything by this brand before, so I was super surprised and tickled to have this. Uh, absolutely stunning, stunning. These colors feel like they feel luxurious you know what i mean i'm trying to swatch some of these just to show you guys um they are gorgeous there's some matte there's some sheen and there's one with a tiny bit of shimmer and i'm telling you this is a stunning everyday look but you can deepen this baby oh my goodness oh my goodness i stopped her oh my gosh are you okay you okay? She's okay. <laughs> Sorry. I, I dropped her into my empties. That was, that could have been a tragedy. But look at that. Absolutely beautiful. And I'm so thankful to have this in my collection. And she's getting, she's getting some love. And she's getting a lot of love lately because she has been in my makeup bag. And the, 
the next the next two eye palettes that I'll show you are ones that I've gotten compliments. So this one I've gotten compliments from um, my husband and my mom when she saw this. Um, and I'll tell you, it's it's one that if, if I had walked by, I would have said, oh, that's pretty. But I may not have stopped to swatch it. And look what I would have been missing. But I'm so, thank you so much, Kristen, for thinking of me. Um, that was an amazing gift, and I really, really, really love it. You're great at gift giving. Um... <laughs> Anyway, and if you don't follow her, please go to her channel and check her out. I'll put her below because um, she makes fabulous videos. And she's a fabulous person. Uh, this is the Tarte Rainforest Palette. Uh, Rainforest After Dark, the Colored Clay Eye and Cheek Palette. This is still out at Ulta. I just saw it not long ago. But this is just the one that has the blush in the center, a highlighter, a bronzer, and then six eyeshades. One, two. Yeah, six. <laughs> and this year they are browns, gold, maroon, and more like mauvey, mauvey gray tones. And I think this is my favorite one out of the three discs that I have. I think the three discs, I think that's all they've made. Um, but I've been wearing this a lot too, and I think it's gorgeous. Uh, this cranberry type color, this maroon cranberry kind of color, is one of my favorites for this time of year. And look at that. And the gold. Don't get me started on anything gold. Look at those two. Absolutely beautiful. They've been getting a lot of love too. This is actually the palette that I took to New York and I just wore this. Um, I think I just took that one. Anyway, love it. And it's still available. And it's an all-in-one kind of palette. So it's easy if you're an on-the-go or you want something for this time of year to keep in your purse. I don't know. It has everything. All you need is some lot oh my goodness Barkley I don't I hope you guys did not hear that <laughs> he tooted anyway I'm so sorry I'll try to edit that out and then the last thing which is you can see it's gotten love because it's fingerprint galore is the it cosmetics um it is the live love laugh vitality disc palette and this was also a gift from my friend Kristen and she raved about this and it was on my list of things to get and I don't know why I just forgot honestly but she sent this to me for my birthday and it has been amazing I am wearing the blush and the highlighter today I actually forgot the bronzer because I'm not sure I've packed the brush up that brush stayed in its little thing uh, because the brush came with it and it's packed nice and safe and can't wait to get it out and start using it but um love this stuff. Uh, I will tell you this, what I love about it, this blush is no joke. I don't need a lot and you know what I like about it? When I put it on in the morning at the end of the, at the, end of the day, it looks like I just put it on. That's what I love about it. It has staying power. Um, gosh, I'm running out of fingers. The highlighter is gorgeous. I am wearing this right here today and um, under my brows and I love it. And the bronzer, let's see. Oh yeah, I can use this finger. And the bronzer is nice. You can you can make this as dark, I think, or as light as needed. Um, I'm more on the light side, so when I tried it, um, when I first got it, more on the light side. But it's beautiful. It is absolutely beautiful. But yeah, the blush, when you blend it out, um, it looks intense. Ooh. Okay, seriously, Jamie. It looks intense, but it's what I'm wearing. It's beautiful. I love it. I hope that my camera and the lighting is doing everything justice today, but who knows. So there are my current favorites. Um, I hope you enjoyed. At least I'm, I'm glad that my favorites that I did today, you can go out and get them if you really want to. Um, no limited edition, no Mac. <laughs> But I'd love to know if you guys have... Well, I'd love to know what your favorites were uh, recently. Huh, it could be makeup products or anything. This this time, it just happened to be all makeup products. But thank you so much for watching. And I hope to be more regular. Uh, if, if you guys have watched the other videos that I've put up recently. Um, well, I don't know in which order they're going up. So I'll just say this. When I'm moving, which is like in the next few days, we're not sure when we're going to be able to have internet connection. So... If this is September when I'm filming this, if it's mid-October before you see this, I'm really sorry because <laughs> we have no control over that right now. But anyway, thank you so much for sticking with me and I will talk to you guys soon. Bye!